Hi class, today I am going to teach you the lesson How do bees make honey from 6th standard English textbook. In this lesson we will learn about how do bees make honey and uses of honey. Let's read the lesson How do bees make honey. Honey is the oldest sweet used by people. It is a natural sugar made by bees. It contains sugar, proteins, iron and calcium. We can digest honey very easily. It calms a cough and soothes a sore throat. It is also known for its ability to kill bacteria. Honey is one of the oldest natural sweeteners used by human beings since ancient times. Honey is made up by honeybees. It contains natural sugar, proteins, iron and calcium and can be easily digested. It is used as a medicine to cure cough and sore throat. It is also a good antiseptic as, as it kills bacteria. Let's, care. Let's understand. What is honey used for? Honey is used as a natural sweetener. It is also used to make Ayurvedic medicine to cure cough and sore throat. It is also used as an antiseptic to cure burns. Next, let us know. Let us now learn about making honey. Honey making is not very simple. Honeybees start the honey making process by visiting flowers and collecting nectar. They gather nectar in the spring when most flowers and plants are in bloom. They use their long tube-like tongues to suck the nectar out of the flowers. Nectar means a sweet fluid produced by flowers and made into honey by bees. In bloom means with the flowers fully open. Honey making is a complex process. Honeybees collect the nectar from flowers mostly during the spring season. They draw the nectar from the flowers through their long tube-like tongues. Let's understand where do bees collect nectar from? Honeybees gather nectar from flowers and plants. They suck the nectar through their long tube-like tongues from the flowers. Next, they store the nectar in their stomachs honey sacs, and carry it to the beehive. While inside the bee's stomach for about half an hour, the nectar mixes with the proteins and enzymes produced by the bees. The nectar is thus converted into honey. The bees then drop the honey into the honeycomb. Hexagonal cells made of wax produced by the bees. The bees repeat the process until the combs are full. Beehive means a structure wherein bees live and make honey. Enzyme means chemical substance that is produced. Honeycomb means a block of wax full of six sides holes in which bees store honey. Hexagonal means having six sides. Honeybees store the nectar in their stomach and carry it to the beehive. The nectar mixes with proteins and enzymes in the honeybees stomach and is converted into honey. Later, the bees store the honey in the beehive in hexagonal cells made of bee wax called honeycomb. Let's understand, where do bees store the honey? 
they store the nectar in their stomach and carry it to the beehive next to prepare for long term storage the bees fan their wings to evaporate and thicken the honey note nectar has 80% water and honey has only about 14 to 80% percent water when this is done the bees cap the honeycomb with wax and move on to the next empty comb so in a nutshell the honey we heat in nectar that honey bees have collected regard regard g dated and dehydrated to enhance its nutritional properties evaporate means turn from liquid into vapor regurgitate means bring food that you have already swallowed back into your mouth dehydrate means remove the water from something to store the honey for the long term the honey bees use their wings as a fan to dry up the water content in the nectar nectar has 80% water and the honey has only about 14 to 18% water when one of the honey combs gets filled up the bees close it with a bee cap and then move on to another cell therefore honey is nothing but nectar collected by the bees and regurgitated and dehydrated to enhance the nutritional properties of honey next honey bees are divided as house bees and field bees the house bees keep the houses clean and well ventilated they build new combs to store honey field bees are older bees they go away from the house their job is to search for nectar there is an excellent example of division of labor among honey bees they divided themselves into house bees and field bees house bees keep the hive clean and well ventilated and build new combs to store honey field bees are older bees they collect nectar and store it in the honey comb next honey bees do not live long at the time of honey gathering season they work very hard as a result the honey bee does not live longer than a month around 2000 bees die every day in a honey making hive the queen bee lays eggs and she maintains the population of the hive honey bees have a short life they live only for a month around 2000 bees die every day in a hive the queen bee only work is to lay eggs and maintain the population of the hive let's understand how long does a honey bee live a honey bee does not live longer than a month okay children from this lesson we have learned that hard work is the key to the success thank you